There we are, welcome to the MCO Compact 5 CNC program Tutor 1. This is just a plain turning operation. The part, the aluminium is already chopped up. The first operation is a facing cut, and then it goes on to do some longitudinal cuts, uh, an outside radius, a taper some internal radiuses and then finally a thread so I'll switch the machine on it's all ready to go I just need to press the start button the first operation of the two facing cuts I removed the tool just clear from the end of the work because I didn't want to do any facing it will come back now. That's gone to an MOO, which is a whole program, waiting for me to bring the tailstock and live centre up to the workpiece. This is rather a large extrusion from uh, extension from the chuck, so I'm using the live centre. So now I'm going to press the start again, which starts the first turning cycle. This is going to reduce the end of the bar to 12 millimetres in length to 6 millimetres in diameter. The spindle speed is 1300 rpm and the feed rate of the tool is 100 millimetres per minute. The depth of cut is 0.5 of a millimetre for each part. So from that you can see that it's going to do 14 passes to complete the 7 mil depth of cut off the radius. We should be finished, we should finish with a 12 mil length of 6 millimetres diameter. I'll leave the video running. It's cutting quite happily at that. We can, you can in fact cut one millimetre depth of cut if you wish, or we could speed it up on the uh, feed rate. We'd probably go to 150 at this point by depth of cut. But this is just a demonstration video, so you can see exactly what happens. At this speed also the chip rake was tending to work, but saving a lot of twisted pieces of cork coming away and binding up around the tool. The material is 6082C6, more commonly known in older times as HE30. It's just put a chamfer on the end. It's now going to reduce the diameter of this next part to 20 millimetres. The outside radius cut, like I said, you'd see. That's a one millimetre depth of cut just on him, on the taper. It's now cutting an internal radius.
spindle has stopped, it now wants a tool change. It's a manual tool change. Quite simple to do. Changing this, going to put in the threading tool. All I have to do then is press the start button again just to continue with the uh, program. This is a one millimetre pitch thread and it's being cut at 450 RPM. The depth of cut is 0 0.03 of a millimetre. Uh, the depth of cut is going to be 0 0.60, so it's going to do 20 passes to cut the thread to the depth of 0 0.6. may benefit from some cutting fluid so I'll give it some oil. Just to help it. You can see there what's been achieved. You can see that the thread, the end is nicely formed. It comes along to a flat shoulder, then you have a, an outside radius and a small parallel portion, a one in five taper and then this recess reduced in, it's, it's cut with uh, cut to a depth of 2.5 millimeters I think going from memory it's just to make a finger grip so that you can you have a gripping point on it that's the idea of it and a small plain parallel shoulder after the last part That's the end of the program. Thanks for watching.